off to the shrine and we're gonna make some rhymes. I'm gonna say the first word and Tess says the second word. Poop. Bring it on. What'd you say? Poop. Poop? You can't rhyme the same word I together. I'm asking a question. Yes, I said poop. In a chicken coop? Uh, uh, uh -huh. let's get a different word. Tree. <laughs> so you can pee? With me. Wee wee. On to the next word. We're gonna rhyme with box. I would love to have a pet fox. I would like to put on some socks. I would love if you used Clorox. To clean my pet ox. <laughs> well, okay, that's... We're at the we're at the shrine now. <laughs> Boy, that passed quickly yeah. with that little rhyming game. Look, we're going to take an elevator down into the tomb of the dirt. Tomb of the dirt. Everyone nice. loves dirt. Tips and tricks. Check this screen for hints that will surely aid you on your journey. The adventurer's heart must never stop seeking knowledge. Look, a puzzle dungeon. To you who sets foot in the shrine, I am Oman Ah, in the name of the goddess of Hylia and all that. I've played the Legend of Zelda. Yeah, you played the first one. This is not anything like that <laughs> one. It's way better. No, it's way worse. What do you mean? It's 3D. And that doesn't make it better. It depends on the game. <laughs> Sheikah Slate Authenticated Distilling Rune. We're getting another drop of knowledge. Oh, yeah, we get the magnet power with this one. Magnet? Magnesis. Magnesis. We get to pick Manipulate up... Manipulate metallic objects. We get to pick up metal boxes and slam them down on enemies and all that. Use rune. Okay. Okay, so you see this metal plate on the ground? I do see that metal plate on the ground. Look. We can, oh, we're strong. We can slam it down on enemies. And now, that would be a good, useful um, power to have. It's it, it's really fun. This game gives you a lot of stuff to play with. People still, like, mess around with it today, even though it came out in 2017. Why did you jump in the water and then I, you just get right back out? I didn't mean to fall in the water. Uh, it was an accident. Look. An accidental falling. Okay. A metal block. And we move that, and then we can just... Oh, that's the wrong button. Do that, and then and push it out of the way. Well, and now holy we can get cow, through. Look at that. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Oh. oh! What was that? A monster. It's like a small version of the big dangerous robots. Oh, it's the mini-me. All right, we got a bridge here, but oh no, there's no bridge on the other side. So you side. just take that one and move it over there, right? Yeah, exactly. I'm a genius. Wee! Hooray! <laughs> Perfect! We'll sell for second best. And then we can also just rip that door open. Yeah! We did it. We beat the puzzle dungeon, the first one. Feel the power! We must talk to the shrunken man! I've played that before. The shrunken man? Where you hold that thing and they tell you your fortune. That guy in the thing. Oh, like... The mechanical, like, yeah. wizard guy? Yeah. What was your fortune? I don't remember. Oh. So why even bring it up? Because I played it once. He's a skeleton. There's a lot of them. I am a humble monk blessed with the sight of goddess Hylia and dedicated to helping those who seek to defeat Ganon. With your arrival, my duty is now fulfilled. He said duty. We're not laughing at duty this time. I already did. <laughs> <laughs> Look, a spirit orb. Everybody needs a spirit orb. With those, we can upgrade our amount of health and stamina. May the goddess smile upon you. Thank you, sir, for your ball. We're gonna have a... <laughs> We're gonna have a what? Ball. Oh! Yeah. Okay. I get it now. <laughs> I didn't know that I was supposed to do something. That's okay, I didn't... I yeah, didn't... you didn't let me know in any way, shape, or form. I think there was a form there. There was no form. Here he comes, paragliding, showing off. I thought he gave us the paraglider. No, remember we got to get him stuff for the paraglider. He he won't trust us to use it to go get the treasure. Well, we don't need it to get the treasure. Clairvoyance or hope, perhaps just something similar. As one gets older, it can become more difficult to see. 
with eyes. Well, yeah, that's why you have to get glasses. Yeah, he's developing cataracts. Cataract attack. That'd uh, work. However, that which is hidden from view can often be crystal clear. But perhaps that is not true for everyone. Oh, ho, ho. Is he a Santa Claus wannabe? He looks, he, I think he is. <laughs> he kind of looks a bit like a, like he <laughs> wants to be a Santa Claus. I think he uh, tried out for Santa, didn't make it, and so then his parents gave him this world to be in charge of. I'd take this world to be in charge of. It's gorgeous. How do there be Santa Claus? The appearance of those towers and awakening of this shrine. I pissed on you. Would you quit pissing? <laughs> it's called a running joke. Down your leg. It's getting away. <laughs> <laughs> you took that joke and ran with it. <laughs> Down your leg. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you sound like a witch. You woke Loki up from his little nap. Oh, well, he's fine. It is all connected to that <laughs> Sheikah slate you carry on your hip there. Harry Glider, please. I have yet to finish speaking, child. Ooh. Long ago, a highly advanced tribe known as the Sheikah inhabited these I these lands. These I. <laughs> it's not an island, it's just land, my bad. It's just land. The great power of their wisdom saved this kingdom time and time again. And again and again. And again and again. And yet again. But their ancient history, I mean... No te technology. Their ancient technology disappeared long ago. Or so it is said. Oh. It is interesting, however, to think... How something like that survived all this time, hidden away in a shrine. Yes, indeed. These shrines are tucked away in numerous places all across the land. On this plateau alone, I believe there are still three more. Ooh. Bring me the treasure from each of those shrines and I will give you my paraglider. Okay, first it was one treasure, now it's three. Yeah, look, we can say that wasn't the deal. Oh, well, I suppose I changed my mind. I'm sure that you won't be a problem for a young go getter like you. Well, no, that's not okay. <laughs> hey, he's he's got seniority over us. He can do whatever the crap he no, pleases. No, he cannot. Once you say something, that's it. It's poof. You can't be changing your mind every five seconds. Since I'm feeling this generous. This is why he's not Santa Claus. Exactly. He failed the test in generosity. He's a bad one. A bad boy. He's a bad, bad boy. <laughs> Since I'm feeling generous, I will also teach you a trick for finding shrines. It's always best to survey the area by looking around from a high point. Let's see here. How about you make your way to the top of that tower again? How about you quit bossing us <laughs> around? Oh, oh, I am afraid not, but don't worry. I have another little trick to share with you over effort. Take a look at the map on your Sheikah Slate. Oh, wow. Like We couldn't have figured that one out. <laughs> See those blue icons? You should recognize the cave where you woke the shrine. Oh, that's two sentences with a yes, comma. Yes, you see that comma? But take a breath. <laughs> the, right, woke, uh, the shrine came from and the tower. You can travel instantly to any of those places with the Sheikah Slate. It's like Dragon Ball Z with uh, instant <laughs> teletransmission. Also, I heard quite some time ago. I do not know if it actually works and such. All right. So, oh, look. Magnet power. Oh, magnet so, powers. Direct. Look. We get baked apples and arrows from breaking these. Yeehaw. I want to get some better. Well, okay. Oh, a treasure chest. This metal treasure chest that you have to pull out of the oh, water with this. Oh, look at that. I'm, I'm digging the magnetics. Yeah. I really am. What's in it? Probably more apples. Amber. Yeah. Let's get something new. How about this treasure chest? Opal. Is there anything uh, that's not just rocks? I guess that's all of it for now. It swims pretty well. Once we meet the fish people, we can swim <gasps> even faster. There's fish people? Yeah, they're called Zoras, and they look awesome. Oh, I'm now I'm getting more excited. This game's got a lot to it. It's just this opening part that takes a while. But don't worry, we'll eventually be on our own little adventure. Woo -woo. All right, and look, we can teleport to the top of the tower immediately. We don't have to climb. I've always wanted to be able to teleport. Teleportation would be epic. Especially if you could, like, here's 50 pounds. I'm just going to drop over there. <laughs> but then you'd have a giant hole in your body and you'd no, be bleeding it would out. No, all re See how you went. <laughs> um, that 50 pounds would just fall as a rock on somebody, and then my body would be... <laughs> <laughs> Why does it have to fall on someone? 
because there are people who just deserve to have a big fat rock land on their heads. That's true. That's why you should be nice to people so the fat rocks don't have to fall on your head. Yeah, kindness uh, equals anti-fat rock. Exactly. exactly. Very it's, well it's said. That's how it works. Very well said. I'm surprised it took you so long to catch up with an old man like me. Can we smack him? I want to. That's so not bad. nice. How did you? Where's a fat rock when you need <laughs> one? Oh, the fat rocks cannot affect me. <laughs> now then, I wanted you to join me up here so I could show you. No, so you mm. could use this <laughs> as a vantage point to your search for the shrine. Hey, didn't say the we both suck at reading. Oh. <laughs> did you know about the scope on your seekers late? Oh, there's a scope? My boy, look through it and you can stick a pin anywhere you'd find your mark on a map. Well, we'll just stick a pin uh, in it then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can use it to mark places. Experience, wisdom, instinct. Call it what you will and believe it only as you please. Go ahead and take a look if you feel inclined to do so. All right, fine. It's like binoculars. Whoa. <laughs> and then we can also do that. <gasps> Whoa. 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 It's so pretty. It's a rainbow. I got to take those off now. We don't need those. Having trouble finding the shrines. No, I'm not. You're... We just looked at him. Okay, well, I want to know if I had to talk to you before I got down the tower again. Well, he had to say, oh, ho, ho, again. Oh, ho, ho. He's you're like, not you're, Santa. Quit you're already using his lines. He already failed being Santa Claus. He failed miserably. All right, we've got a couple more magical powers we have to collect before we can leave oh, the Great magical Plateau. magical powers. Okay. I don't know. I'm still liking the magnetism quite a bit. The magnet is one of the best ones, but there are some other cool ones. But if you had that power and women were wearing underwire bras. <laughs> That'd be dangerous in the wrong hands. It would be bad. <laughs> Don't let a pervert have magic powers. Yeah, we better save that for the pure of heart. It's a bad idea for everyone involved. Yep. Yep, just the pure of heart. I'm like a fly on a guy. <laughs> on a wall. <laughs> Job by his shrine. Easy for you to say. It is, because I am very good with my mouth and words and all and that. And I'm not. Down the elevator we go. Time for the next puzzle. Yay! <laughs> Do you need to take your shoes off? Yeah. Take them off. Are you sure? Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> I, I poop in the corner of this room. It's, I doubt your feet's going to make it smell even worse in here. You think my feet stink? <laughs> no. Saying they won't stink. You No, you said it won't stink as bad as your poop. It doesn't. If your feet smelled worse than literal crap on the floor, then that would be an issue. But they don't. Exactly. I'm not saying they do. Are you going to get somebody to rub my feet for me? I don't have that kind of money. Oh. Unfortunately. If I had the money, I'd buy you a personal foot rubber, but I, I, I don't. A, I need a personal foot rubber. Need... Yeah. I think it's more like want. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> we got bombs. Bombs? Bombs, baby. Well, watch out for us. Look. Ooh. Then we throw it. Then we can de de detonate it whenever we want. Oh, I'm liking bombs. The bombs are very cool in this game. What's in the orange chest? Is it Tropicana? No, it's a Traveler's Ooh. Claymore. What's hey, a Traveler's oh. Claymore? Look at that giant sword. Oh, that sword's bigger than he is. Whoa, 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 whoa. Bah. You're going to make me puke if you keep doing that. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. I don't want you puking on the floor. How about on the door? Uh, how about on... Um, how about on the shore? How about on the man who is poor? Okay, no, look at I this. Look, on look, look. Man. I'm watching. I'm watching. I'm sail away. Look at that. Oh, it's cool. I yes. love it. Yes. These bombs are one of the best parts You're of the game. You're a bombardier. I'm. I'm gonna bomb some deer. No, you are a bombardier. It's bombardier. No, you just think oh, you know oh, everything. Look, look, look. Is that a slide? Mm, well, okay. Look, you put the. Circle oh, you bomb. put the bomb down there. The tube. 
Then the, rolls down there. And then it shoots it over there. And oh, boom. that's sweet. It's all the, That's fun. They have a lot of fun with these puzzle dungeons. You know it'd be really fun? What? If somebody rubbed my feet. I'm, I should have figured that was the answer. <laughs> but no, I was foolish. We did the puzzle dungeon. Hooray. And your to toenail polish looks great. Thank you. I, d I did a top coat. I did the, I did the colors. I use Maybelline. <laughs> I don't do that. I'm a I'm a real man. I use mud. Mud. <laughs> mud and glue. That's my mud toe. And glue. <laughs> I glue stones to my toenails. <laughs> Extra strength. You're a little too manly. Hey, if they can't keep up, like that's you just, need a real woman. That's just how it is to be with the real man. I need a woman who bathes in. Um, mud. And eats bugs. You don't really want a woman like that. I don't. She'll have those little wing crisps stuck between her teeth. Ew, that's disgusting. I know, right? It's so gross. Grody. Uh, now, I'm sorry, but those don't look scary at all. They're skeleton by Coblins. But they don't look scary at all. <laughs> I blew myself up on accident. They look ridiculous. Well, not ridiculous. They look cute. And look, we got his arm as a weapon. Oh, we're gonna use his arm as a weapon? Yeah. That's Look, terrible. We also got a shield. You never use shields. In this one, there you can you can use them as sleds in this one. Oh, that'd be cool. It is cool. They did that in Scooby Doo too. This is just like Scooby Doo. Yeah, we're basic. This is basically Legend of Zelda: The, the Scooby Chronicles. Yes. Yeah. I love it. Uh oh, they're coming out of the ground. Don't worry, I can climb the wall. Out. They'll he be threw coming a out the me. ground as you climb. Hoot, hoot. They'll be coming out the ground as you climb. Hoot, hoot. They'll be coming out hoot, the ground. They'll hoot, be coming out hoot, the ground. Hoot, They'll be coming out hoot. the ground while you climb. Oh no. Keys. All right, there's the next shrine we got to get to. Top of the mountain. All right. Let's take the bacoblin arm and throw it at these keys. They're not like those. Oh, oh my. <laughs> he exploded in a fiery branch of your. Oh my. I'm so proud of you, son. Thank you, Ma. You always know just what to say to lift my spirits. Now that's what your mama's here for. We got an acorn. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Stay away from the beehive. Now, my brother and I, when we were youngsters, our father worked at a hospital. My father. And there was a park right on the grounds of the hospital. And we'd have to wait in the car for him to get off work. Mm -hmm. So my little brother and I would go in that little park and we would collect those little acorns. Ah. And we had quite a little collection, I might say. What would you say is the best acorn you ever had? Well, the Buckeyes were the best ones. I like you know, Buckeyes. They're big. Yeah. And you gotta shine those babies up. Look, a little cabin. <gasps> oh. The but there's somebody in it. It's the oh. old man. Oh, ho, fancy that, so we meet again! He you... scared me a little bit with that. Yeah, that was him, not me. Well, he needs to, to just a little bit. Settle down a little bit? Little... Okay. Yeah, because I was going to love the cabin, and then he scared me. <laughs> After a day like this, I'm exhausted. Ahem. Thank God. I'm afraid I'll be needing my bed. You can use my bed anytime you need for us to bed, and assuming there's not already in it, of course. There's a fire outside if you're looking to pass the time. I'm getting sick of the old man. How is your shrine exploring? <laughs> gotta go. Just, you gotta go? I was talking I was talking about that. Oh. Okay, we're gonna cross this by... Chopping down a tree. Yeah, and making a little bridge out of it. Timber! Hooray, it actually worked. Uh, oh. oh, you be so careful when you cross that log, mister. I will be careful, mother. I did it. Phew! Yeah. That was stressful. I'm just trying to see what time it is. She's not paying attention. I kind of am. <laughs> yeah. I'm paying attention as much as I can. Well, you know that I have ADD. Yeah, I know. That's why I gave you a pencil to fiddle Yeah, but with. the pencil doesn't really help. I know. You can get on your phone. I don't care. It's... I'm not going to get on my phone. I just wanted to see what time it was. I'm, I'm just saying you can get on your phone if you want. <sighs> you naggity nag naggers. I might... I was, I was close to a word that would get us in trouble. Then don't nag me. That's uh, Yes, ma'am. I, I will not nag. Thank you. I will instead 
take a Walmart bag <laughs> and fill it. To your old hag of a mother? Yes. <gasps> no, no. Oh. I, no, okay, here's what, oh. here's what happened, okay? Oh. No, okay. Oh. Okay, okay, what happened was I I couldn't think of a word to rhyme with bag. Mm-hmm. And then you said hag. Mm-hmm. And I said yes to that. No, I said hag of a mother before you no, said yes no, to that. No, before you finished your sentence, no. I had already completed no. my thought. No. I didn't call you an old hag. All right, so here's the thing. Yes. I love my son. <laughs> I sacrificed raising him pretty much by myself. It was an accident. I made sure he had the best schooling humanly possible. I made sure that he can do what he needs to do. I make sure he has what he needs to have. And he calls his mother just after she turns 60. <sighs> A hag bag. That's not what happened. He called me a hag bag. I didn't. And I'm such a sweet woman. You if you are. knew me, if you knew me, you would like me. Because I would like say nice things to you. And I would be sweet. <laughs> I would and I would remember sweet, your birthday. Your and I would I would spoil you at Christmas. Don't expect me to remember your birthdays when I suck I suck at dates. No, it's not that you don't remember birthdays, it's that you called me a hag bag.